What is a saint? Who is a righteous man? Who is a righteous woman? A saint is a normal Christian. The problem with us is that we have become too abnormal. That we take sin as normal, we take sin as ordinary, and we look at holiness as extraordinary. It is not so. Because the plan of God for us is holiness. God created us in order to be saints. Do not dream of anything less than that. And the source of so much desolation in the world is our abandonment of the call to be saints. There are different approaches to holiness. There are different approaches to perfection. For the Greeks, it is the pursuit of perfection. It is to remove all imperfections. It is to hone your spiritual muscles to get rid of all those defects so that you will reach the level of perfection. The other mindset, the other paradigm about perfection is the Hebrew understanding of holiness. It is not about not falling. It is not about not making a mistake. Perfection in our Judeo-Christian tradition is walking with God. I am broken. God makes me whole. I walk with Him. I am wounded. God sends me to heal. God walks with me. In other words, perfection, holiness, sanctity is not just about not making a mistake ever. It is not about not falling. It is not about not being tempted. It is rather about walking every step and allowing God to be your companion. That is why Pope Francis has time and again insisted that the church should be a church that accompanies. Accompanying sinners. Accompanying the confused. Accompanying those who are lost. We must be a church that walks, that accompanies. Because sanctity is really only walking in the Lord. You have fallen. You have skeletons in the closet. The important thing to remember is rise up and start again and allow the Lord to hold you by the hand and then walk again with the Lord. If you let go of the hand of the Lord, most likely you will fall. As Peter walked on the waters, but he started to doubt and he started to sink. Lord, save me, you man of little faith. Believe that I am with you. Believe that I am walking with you. And it is I walking with you. And it, God alone suffices. God alone is enough to accompany us in our journey through life. You want to be happy? Be holy. Because the sure way to joy is holiness. But you want to be holy? and you look at your imperfections, don't say, I am a useless creature already. Don't say, I am a lost cause. Don't say, I have no more hope. If you just allow the Lord to walk with you, with your wrinkles and faults, the Lord will make all things new in your life. Blessed are the righteous, Blessed are those who seek perfection. Blessed are those who seek holiness, not by themselves, but by walking in the path of the Lord. You want to be holy? You want to find consolation? Aim at holiness. Walk in righteousness. There is no other path. 
Righteousness is the path. Righteousness, holiness is the destiny. It is the plan of God for you.